on your basic bodies, measure the desired depth of your neckline. The cow neckline will make this drop even lower, so keep that in mind when you choose a number. It's 6 inches for me. Draw a straight line across like this and cut out your basic pattern. Cut off the upper part on the 6 inches line you drew so that you have a, let's call it a tube bodice. To create the cow neck, draw one or more lines from the center front to the armhole and to the top of the tube bodice. It's the slash and spread technique and the goal is to open up the pattern to create fullness where you want it. Knitting your lines with a tool or not, it doesn't matter much. Get a pair of scissors and cut on those lines. Cut nearly to the end, leave a tiny part uncut so that the whole thing is still connected but you can play around with the pieces. Place the pattern on a rightly sized paper, now begin to spread them. Open them up as much as you'd like. The more you open, the more fullness you will have. The spaces between them may or may not be equal, just play around. When you're satisfied with the fullness you've created, tape down all the pieces in place, then cut out what is now the new bodies. You could draw a new line to represent the edge of your neck like this and even use this line as a chance to create more fullness. Trim all edges and cut away the useless parts. We're almost there. You want to avoid the pointy edge that would be hard to work with when sewing. So, remove that pointiness by drawing a blunt curve and cutting out the unwanted part. This is the final result. Please subscribe. Mm -hmm.